Shalom, shalom, Israel, shalom. I am the Moray Aria Israel, just one of the co-founders, uh, co-founders or founders right here for Liberation Tabernacle of Yala. I hope I can get my words right. <laughs> yes, sir. Along with my brother, uh, the Moray David Israel. Yes, sir. He's not going to be on the video tonight right here, my, uh, my brother and sister with me. But yes, sir. Just want to come in here just to give y'all a message tonight. This quick message. Not going to be in here long if I ever most high is willing. But uh, first and foremost, before we get into that, we want to say all praises. All glory and all honor goes to none other than the most high indeed. You know, we might say Yah, we say it's for short a lot of time, we say Yah, or we say Yahi Wahi. Yes, man, indeed. The most high, yes, sir, indeed, my brothers and sisters. All praise. So again, shalom to you, Israel. Thank y'all for tuning in. And those of you who uh might not acknowledge, you know, your heritage and your identity as being an Israelite. I say peace to you as well. Yes, sir, because shalom just only means peace. So we send our peace to you as well. Thank you for tuning in. And everybody who have been subscribing, we greatly do appreciate you for subscribing and uh, sharing your time and just trying to hear the word of the Most High. And as we try to encourage and influence, uh, be a great influence, like we have been influenced ourselves before we uh, came into the knowledge that we was Israel. And uh, it's been a great thing, man, to know that you are Israel, not only that, but to serve the Most High. And that's what I want to talk about a little bit right here today. And then I want to show you all a little bit how you can stay linked up with us on our podcast site because we don't do everything right here actually on this channel. <clears throat> we do a lot of some things on uh, one of the other channels. So let me show you all that one right fast. And then I'm going to get into the, the message that I want to share with y'all tonight. You can follow us and keep up with our podcast. We don't, we do it on talkshoe.com because everything we don't do right here on YouTube, you know, everything we don't do actually on YouTube, you know, we just been kind of periodically trying to get back into doing this YouTube thing. But uh, our, our podcasting site that we actually host from as well for our podcast is uh, right there on talkshoe.com. You can see it on the screen, talkshoe.com is where we host our different podcasts and see like on uh, the fifth uh, the Moray he did a, a class entitled the Torah is the missing key to success the Torah is the missing key to success and right there y'all y'all seen this one on YouTube you, you know you can follow, see this show and listen to this show again right here we did uh, we're all Israelites ever unite as one nation again now we did that one right there uh, we did it. We, we actually streamed it and recorded it right here on talk show because you can do uh, videos as well right here on talk show. And sometimes we periodically do that where we record a show or I might record a show live right here and do a class on uh, talk show. And sometime I might upload it to YouTube, but you can see all the different classes that we have had uh, right there that you can go and check out brothers and sisters uh, right there on because on Monday night, my brother, he do uh, about 7 p.m. Central Time. He do one, one called Lines by Radio uh, on there as well every Monday night right there on Talk Show. And it's called and you can see now I have all this in the description. I have the link to it in the description where you can find that. But I'm going to give you all the different ways you can actually listen to it as well. But see right there, um, the lines by radio rebuilding your body he did one a couple of weeks ago. So, yes, sir, brothers and sisters, you can catch that right there on Talk Shoe. But also, you don't just have to go to Talk Shoe if you want to, because sometimes we do the videos on that. That's what I'm telling you about Talk Shoe. And, uh, but you can actually catch the, the, the podcast right there on all the major distributing sites, such as, you know, podcasting sites. You can catch it right there on iHeartRadio, TuneIn Radio, uh, Apple Podcasting. Amazon, yes, Liberation Tabernacle of Yah is on Amazon as well. So you can catch us on every major podcasting site. You can catch, uh, however you listen to different podcasts, you can check out Liberation Tabernacle of Yah, and that way you can tune in and listen to all these episodes from the classes that we do right there. So I just want to share that with y'all, my brothers and sisters. So like I said, some things that we don't do right here on YouTube that we do <clears throat> right there on the podcast and site. So, you know, we, so, you know, if you might not see us on here on YouTube doing something, uh, we might be on the podcast and site doing some things, uh, as well. So yes, sir, brothers, so I just want to share that with y'all, uh, sister and brother, but today I just want to come in here and just talk to you right fast momentarily about, um, don't let anyone dis dis discourage you in serving the most high. Don't let anybody discourage you in serving the most high. 
Yeah, because you, you might not think that happened, but it does. Let me get this glitter glare out of my eyes. It 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 does, and I, I tell you, I've I've been in that situation myself, a time or two, where listening to other people sometimes and. And, and, and certain things that they might throw at you, man, I don't know why you believe in that old God stuff, man. What God at now how, with all this stuff happening, man? You know, God letting babies fall out of windows. God letting all this stuff happen to us and so-and-so this. And that. that's before I really was really rooted, rooted in truly in Tanakh. Now, you know, I was in the Bible, but you know, most of it through Christianity and all this stuff, other stuff. And, you know, uh, and it, even with my uh, Islamic days and, you know, what he was like, certain things though and, and you will be like yeah man what god it anyway yeah where well, yeah. you know it be in, in sometime in the baby in the back of your mind yeah man he show sure like man I'm, i don't know i'm, I'm kind of questioning this my own self man what the most i had too bro i, I kind of see what you mean but see when you really rooted into not and you understand about the what we say the curses i i, I said the curses and the chastisement <laughs> And, see, and it took a while for me to get there and you know why well, i had to get into the knock because like i said i wasn't rooted in knock i was in all this christianity and messianic things of this nature but people will be in that man and, and especially in these days and times what we're seeing um people will come to you man and try to show enough discourage you and even we got brothers like for us who's rooted in knock we're rooted in knock what they call old testament only we <laughs> I've seen a video just the other day and I'm not gonna go deep into that it, it just it was some so-called messianics and I say so-called messianics having the I guess a discussion with he was out on the street having a camp whatever and a brother who Tanakh only came by and and they was talking about how they now check it out they calling us Tanakh only saying we are wicked we are wicked, man, because we do not want to sell their their idol, their uh, star. It's like they 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 try to use the if, if you wear the, uh, uh, the 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 Morgan David or the, the Shield of David, they said that's a six point star or Moloch and Rim fan and all of that. But they, if they really read it and say that's the star of your God, see, they star God is or their star power is Yahweh Shah, aka Jesus Christ, Yahshua, whatever they want to call them. That's their star God. See, they don't understand. They don't really understand that 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 that, 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 um, that precept there when it says the star of your God, basically your favorite. That's your favorite idol. They don't understand that, but that's that's neither here nor that. So they was <laughs> because we don't want to accept their star God, their favorite idol. We are, are, are wicked. Hmm. And they will, and they have probably discourages some people themselves and made them go into the Yahweh Shai doctrine a worship because they made them feel bad about not following them because you don't have a sacrifice huh you don't have a sacrifice how you get your sins cleansed if you don't have a sacrifice you know you can't do it in the temple no more Yahweh Shai the one died for you how you get your sins uh, uh, repented for and all of this I just asked the most high <laughs> That's it. But anyway, and then you have those been in situations where you have those who there's no such thing as God. The black man is God. The black man and the well, they gonna say the black woman, but he said the black man. Well, yeah, some said the black woman is God. Not God is. The black woman is God. Now we use we know we have words like God and goddess. Well, how is the black woman God then? If that's a, I don't know if that's a masculine principle or male. I mean, but how is she God? I don't know. So maybe that's some trans trans thing. I, I ain't gonna get into that right there. But you calling her God, not that God is, you know. But everything, if I, and I've been down some of those paths, brothers and sisters. I've been down some of those paths myself. Um, but let me get back on track. But the thing we can't get this is this discouraged, my brothers and sisters. And and I know sometimes it, it 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 will be to some people if you're really not rooted 
hadn't been deeply rooted yet in in certain things. It may be questionable in your mind. You might question the most high. But I tell you, man, I tell you, I've 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 seen some things and that's why now I've I've cut people out of my life. I could I've I've I had to cut I just cut people out of my life. When if you don't if okay, if you don't want to believe you don't have to believe. Listen, you can believe in a pork chop sandwich if you want. And I, I'm not saying I hate to use that analogy. I don't know how that came out. You can believe in the ice cream deity. You can believe what you want to. That's you. I, 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 I'm, I don't have myself. You don't have the answer to me. You don't have the answer to me in the end. I don't. You don't have the. T- I, I mean, nothing I can do to. Um, I don't have the. The what's it called? The rulership of your soul. But the only thing I can do as a brother is try to advise you, try to guide you in a, in a direction and show you, I know what the most I've done for me. I know. And I've, I, and, and how do I believe, man, because of the things that I've been in situations that I've been in, it wasn't it, like I tell people, man, Hey, it wasn't me, man. It wasn't me that saved my life. And in certain situations, it, it, it wasn't me, man. It was something I tell people, it's a higher power. And some people need to question me and, you know, like they don't believe it. Hey, but listen, I ain't going to make you believe. I, I've, I've witnessed. I can only tell you what I've witnessed. And maybe it was, you going to have to go through some things. Not y'all, but listen, people have to go through things. And then maybe one day their belief. And people have a have a problem with that word believe. I, I don't know how how under uh, other way to uh, explain it. You know, that's the English word. You know, I don't want to understand. I mean, have a a better word to explain. But you believe, man. Hey. But I I, I know that the Most High is real. I'm telling you, certain situations that I've been in and certain things in my life and how well, I've came from the. Man, I tell you, the most high power was real to me. I don't, if nobody else believe it, I, I bet you I do. <laughs> I ain't going to bet you, but I, 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 I guarantee you, the most high proven is real in my life. So there's no discouraging me away from the most high. Like I said, I've, I've, I've like I said, raised in the Christian household. Well, my family never really just, you know, taught me the Bible like that. Um, when I got incarcerated, the time I was going to Bible study, I took up, man, all kind of Bible classes and courses, got certificates out the frame. I mean, you know what they say, out the frame. I mean, I got a lot of certificates and Bible courses, and, but all under Christianity, doctrinated in Christianity. Um, then in there, I, I took Shahada. Uh, I started studying in Islam, practicing Islam and things of that nature. I practiced Islam for a couple of years, probably about five to seven years. And, um, after that, I went in, into the comedic doctrine. You know, I was I studied as an Awabian, and um, but the thing though, before I, I've said this several times, before Doctor York got locked up, at the time that he actually got locked up, he was telling us that we were the true children of Israel. He was telling us that we were the true children of Israel. But even though we was going into some of those things, the the, uh, the messianic thing. He was telling us that we were the true children of Israel. Let me, excuse me, let me, let me step up. Let me get this book and I'm going to show y'all this book right fast. Let me, let me get this book. Excuse me for stepping away from the mic. Excuse me for stepping away from the mic. Yes, sir. But I got to show y'all. This is a book right here. Now, one thing about it, we was somewhat messy. Well, we were messianic, I guess he can say, right? Because he was still talking about Yeshua and things of that nature, right? But one thing about it though that that Dr. York still didn't do, uh, that he yeah he didn't he didn't we went into, we were not following Paul, we was not following Paul, we was not into that Pauline doctrine, and here's a book, that he wrote, it used to be it was a revised version, it was used to be the book it was called Paul no what was it. Jesus Christianity versus Paul Christianity or something like that at first. Then they changed it to the black man Christianity or white man Christianity. But I think at first the original, it was just a small little book. They used to sell for five dollars at one time. I think it was Jesus Christianity versus Paul Christianity. And and but in this book here, 
and even though we know we're not we're not messianic, but even in this book, he goes in and he breaks down talking about how Paul doctrine is different from a Paul even teach differently from what they would say Yeshua, Yahweh Shai, whatever we want to say, but we were saying Yahshua. So even with that, it, it led me on the path of letting me know again that we were the church we were the children of Israel. And this is what he was teaching us. Even though we was, you know, still saying Yahshua and stuff was uh was the the savior and things of that nature and like that. But it's that put me on the path though. Even with that put me on the path of because I had well, I was going to get back in all of that Kim and stuff but it put me on the path of and, and but when he got locked up we stayed in it in the Wabi, we I was still in it we, we stayed in it for a while and then they switched back over they did the flea flicker they switched back over to um, uh, the Egypt stuff the, going back into Kim and all of that and you know I went back that way too but uh, and then eventually though the, the, the long story short I'm back where I need to be, man. I'm back where I need to be, you know, because I made the most high promise a long time ago. Like he made a promise to us as Israel, you know, <laughs> and, I, you know, we got to keep those promises. We got to keep those promises because he's surely going to hold you to those promises. But the most high have shown me so many, what they say, y'all, grace, as they say in the New Testament, or he showed me so, not just in the New Testament, it's all over, but he surely have showed me grace and showed me favor. I'm telling you, I've, I've seen it. So I have no reason not to trust, believe in the most high, in the most high of God. And, 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 and on this path, it, it, man, I've been coming across a lot of, uh, and I, I didn't never know this stuff, man. It's like, it's like right there, coming across a lot of great teachers, even the other teachers I listen, because like I said, I'm a student still, man. I'm a student now. I'm, I, I ain't never say I know it I, I, enough. You know, I'm a still a student myself, so I listen to a lot of, like I said, I like to listen to a lot of classes with different uh, teaching mores and just classes and everything. I like to learn myself. Oh, and I got to show y'all, this is one of the new books I've got myself, brothers and sisters. Ooh, we, I really hadn't got in deep into it yet because, you know, I'm still reading one of my other books from my other brother right here. Brother, uh, 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 and I think this, think this brother, they're students, student teachers, master teachers, and student teachers. So I still got this one right here, brothers, I got to finish getting into. I mean, finish reading itself because um, I be just reading read a book jumping all over instead of, instead of getting my talk to knock and everything but i still got this one my brother uh, uh, uh yeshaya israel yes sir still got this one and i th and this one right here man it, this 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 elder oh man P powerful and uh i've been following his is his his youtube channel uh and i hadn't seen the brother on youtube in a while so uh, may the peace and I mean not peace and blessing be the most high be with him. I hope and I'm praying the most high that everything is well. Just hope you're just hoping that he took some time off or something. Uh, you know, just when you just see a you know brother, just you don't see something born and you don't see him for me. Like, uh oh, I'm wondering what's going on. I hope everything is going well. I hope he's in good health. But, you know, I know he's an elder brother and uh, man, he has been putting in a, some work for a mighty long time, brothers and sisters. And this and this walk is trying to help us educate ourselves of Israel. Coin Michael Ben Levy, man. This is I've just heard him on a, on a YouTube video talking about this. And I said, man, and, and, and I seen the book. I said, oh, I got to get it. Got to get it. Israelites and the Jew, the significant difference. And man, it is a difference, your brothers and sisters. So this is this is another one to get right here, my brothers. So this is another must have for your library. Yes, sir. I think this one was only like on uh, Amazon uh twenty two dollars and man come on y'all but this information of knowing who we are and educating ourselves to get back to our here hey man it, it it really ain't no it's, it's ain't no price tag to it i'm I'm just saying y'all ain't no price tag to it but i just give y'all you know just the price uh so you would know but 
I'm getting into this one deep, man. I'm getting. I, I got into the first chapter already, cause I'm so I'm reading two books at once, man. I'm <laughs> I'm in two. Well, actually three, cause you know, still got to. Cause he's gonna get, take you in still back into the Tanakh, cause they make references and things in the Tanakh precepts and things. So I'm reading both of it at the same time, brothers. So I'm reading both at the same time, you know. So yes, sir, and thanks to these good, good brothers for their um, their wonderful work. And the scholarship that they're giving us as Israel and giving us this information to uh, so we can equip ourselves into learning our history, learning our culture and truly serving our most high power. That's number one, serving our most high power and quit giving reverence, reference and reverence. That's the word I'm looking for, y'all reverence and, 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 and calling on everybody else. But our most high power. Mm. I can truly understand now what he mean when he said that I am a jealous Elohim. Y'all know what I mean? When I am a jealous Elohim, if I've done so much for you, it's just like a regular father. You know, he's taking care of his child. He's been doing this for his child and doing this for his child. And there may be, you know, him and the mother. Yeah, I can't put the most high in this situation, though. If it's not. <laughs> but there's somebody else that's coming along and he's getting all the credit um, for so-called doing something. You know, you think of this child, this child. Yeah, I'm doing this for you. Uh, I'm dead that a child is giving another person credit. Maybe the stepfather. But the, per, the the biological father is the one who's actually taking care of him, making sure you're having food to eat, clothes on his back, he or she on that back. But this person here is getting all the credit, and he ain't done nothing. He ain't done a thing. <laughs> and that's how the, that's how we're doing with the Most High when we are calling on all these other idols. But it's the Most High who is the one who's doing. These wonderful works for us. The Most High is the one waking us up in the morning, setting us on our way. It ain't nobody else. It ain't no you know, I was shy, of, aka so and so, so and so. Because even, even is it not even in that so-called New Testament? What did he say? Yeshua, your aka your I was shy. Jesus said that I can do nothing of myself. But whatever I see the father do, I do. So why do I need Yahawashai when I can go straight to the father? Hmm? Again, is it not said that whatever I can do nothing of myself. So if you can do nothing of yourself, you can't do nothing without the, without the father doing it. What I need you for. Why don't I just go straight to the father? Hmm? Because is, is that not what Israel done? Because is that, come on now. It, it, wasn't that what Israel was already doing in the first place? Going straight to Abba? Huh? Going straight to the father. They didn't need no intercession between nobody in the Most High. But all of a sudden we get to these New Testament writers who write, and who so-called wrote now and we don't even know of none of this stuff is true about what they said this person aka yeshua aka yahweh shy j g j you know the dude name we don't know what this if this guy what we don't know a lot of people say they don't even even know if he existed some people say he did but we don't know what he actually did or, or said we don't have a book of yahshua huh we get other people, basically third party people saying or second party, whatever you want to say, who's saying what he said. We don't know. So actually, you know, <laughs> when sometimes we be we be even as us Tanakh brothers and sisters, we might go against and say, well, you know, Jesus lied. Hell, we don't really we don't know what the brother said. Because we don't know these are what basically right now, basically all we have is what they say, y'all. He said, she said. That's it. That's all we got. Just what other people said, the brother said. I'm going to say the brother because then I don't know. Some people. Say, we don't know what he, we, we don't know what he said, y'all. Honestly. This is what, according to what? Matthew. According to who? Mark. According to who? Luke. 
John. We don't know what the, what did what he said. Or uh, if he said anything at all, y'all. We don't know. But anyway, brothers and sisters, just be in, be encouraged. And um be truly encouraged. Don't don't let nobody discourage you. Stay encouraged. Don't let nobody discourage you about serving the most high. You know what the most high is doing in your life. And see, a lot of people, they get just, they, they might be frustrated with the most high because maybe it's some things they ain't did. They not doing right. Right. It's like, it's like anything else. A miserable person will want somebody else to be miserable, miserable with them. Right. So that's how a lot of people live with the most high. They mad at the most high. So they don't want you to serve the most high because they mad at the most high. They, they don't want they don't want no they don't want you to have no joy because it's some they didn't keep their agreement their own covenant with the most high so they they they, they gonna take you down they want you to be mad at the most high too hmm? they thought that they was gonna get a blessing by doing something which they didn't ever keep they end of the bargain so they figure you shouldn't get down either they unhappy so they want you to be unhappy with the most high too Ain't no such thing as God. See, some of our brothers and sisters have been so-called mind polluted as, as well with a lot of this doctrine out here. They think they God. They said, hey, I'm the, I'm the, we God. The black man is God. Well, well why in the Jane Brown get down? May the peace and blessing be up on the soul of Jane Brown. It is my alternative Christ, profanity word. <laughs> um, if, if the so-called black man was God, why in the heck? Are we not or hadn't eradicated all the violence and all the the madness and chaos that ensues in our community? Hmm. God, why you hadn't made anything manifest, God? You still run around here hollering what the white man is doing. But you God. The most high power. Y'all don't see well anywhere where we see that. Hashe time or the enemy did anything to whoop the most high, put the most high in bondage. But you the most high power. You, 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 you God in flesh. You I I'm not claiming to be the most high. And well, I know a lot of brothers say they did the most high in flesh. We had a lot of, you know, people came to say, I'm the most high in flesh, but I'm not even saying I know they probably get and, and it's the trip part. And most of the people who say they don't even believe in the concept of God, they don't deal with none of that. But they sure will read Psalms. They sure will read Psalms. We are all gods. Children of the most high God. They believe that. That's the only, that's the only thing they quote. They, that's the only part of the Bible they believe. We are gods. Children of the most high God. Well, how we been? No, take that back. Y'all don't even believe that because it says we are all gods. Children of the Most High God, but you don't believe in God, or you don't believe in the Most High. So how? how you, so you don't believe? You just believe portions of when it just said we are gods, we are Elohim, and then they don't even understand that one. That was talking to the children of Israel, the the kings and the priests and the leaders of the children of Israel. But they they don't even. And and here's the cold part: Israel don't let nobody else just, just along with. Try to discourage you about believing in the Most High or serving the Most High. Let nobody tell you not Israel. We got a lot of brothers out here and sisters out here who get mad at us because we said we Israelites. We Israel. Y'all ain't no Israelite. Prove you are Israelite. Prove to, prove to me that you are what you are. Yeah, no, no ask for my ID. Do you show me your damn ID? <laughs> You want me to show you who I am? Show your identification first. You claiming to be this. You claiming to be that. Show me who you are. I ain't got to show you. Are you mad? Because we say that we are. And they say like the people of the book. We are the Israelites. We saying that oh, we are God's chosen. Hmm. We are special people unto the Most High. Hey man, that's a heavy price too that you got to carry. Now that's some weight on our shoulder. Now y'all, you look at here now. Just saying you Israel. That's some weight on your shoulder. Because you have a duty and obligation with just saying you're Israel now. But they they don't even want us to claim to be Israel. They are rather for the people over there. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Over there in the land now. 
for them to say they are. They don't even say Israelites. Israelis, Jews. They had brother for them. They ain't gonna they ain't gonna argue with them. We see it on sign of the TV all the time, right? They don't argue with them. They ain't argue about them about who they are. They but they they hurry up and argue with us as Israelites about who we are. Who we are saying that we are. They want to argue with us though. They want to argue with us. Y'all ain't no Israelites. Okay, we're not Israel. Who are we then? Who are we? Tell us. We listening. If we're not the people of the book, we don't fit the descriptions. Because the people, like even with Deuteronomy 28, y'all know Deuteronomy 28. Show me where anybody else fit that description. Anybody else have went through Deuteronomy 28, uh, is, is go, are going through Deuteronomy 28 right at this moment. Show it to me. Show it to me. And I'll take this shirt off. Israelite. Won't even wear it no more. Show me if anybody else, anywhere in there, if anybody else has fit that description. Any other so-called nationality fit that description but us. Because we still going through it. We still fulfilling those things right now. When you talk about a hard head, stiff neck people, I'm, I'm, hey, hey. Because I know I'm one of them. I was one of them. Hard head and a mother sucker. Boy, still again today, you uh, people, hard head, stiff neck people. We tell Isaiah, I'm sending you to a people. With it. I'm sending you to a people who's hard head. <laughs> it's a hard head, stiff neck people. They don't want to listen to nothing. They hard head. Let me get. Let me pull it out right fast. I was like, I when I read that man, I got back into this Tanakh, and I was reading it. I was like, yep. Let me see here. Let's go to uh, uh, let's go to Isaiah. Let me see. Can I screen share it? Let me see. Can I screen share this? Some sister brothers. Let me pull this out. Let me pull up my Esau. Let me take this off of here right fast, and try to pull up my Esau brothers and sisters right fast. I'm gonna get this uh, Ezekiel, Ezekiel man. Let's go there. Taking a little time, brother. So it's getting there. Yes, sir. When I first read this, I was like, yeah, I know some people like that. I know some people like that. And uh, right off top, man, let me see. I'm trying to get to you, brothers and sisters. Okay, I'm th I think I can screen share it. Okay, give me a second, brother and sisters. I'm trying to see how to do this right here. Okay, because I'm using the software I hadn't used in a long time. Okay. Here we go. Let's see. Let's transition. Okay, let's go here. Okay, here we go. Now this is Ezekiel two and um, <clears throat> excuse me, two and starting at verse one. Now this is the this is from my complete Jewish Bible. Y'all know I study with different one. This is from my complete Jewish Bible, and this is what it says right here. It says he said now because I got Esau. Y'all see, I got different versions of there. The Seifers, complete Jewish Bible, easy to read, good news Bible, King James, the uh the, the Tree of Life and the um uh what's the other one, y'all? The uh the scripture Bible, yes sir. Indeed. But uh anyway, it says that uh Ezekiel two and one it says, He said to me, it's talking about Ezekiel, human being. Now some of them says son of man, right? Stand up. I speak to you. I, uh, I want to speak to you. And he spoke to me, a spirit entered me and put me on my feet. And I heard him who was speaking to me. He said, human being, I am sending you to the people of Israel, to a nation of rebels who have rebelled against me. They and their ancestors have been transgress transgression against me to this very day y'all see what it says to this very day and that is so true he was speaking to isaiah saying that back then right and 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 sure enough he that can still be said today they and their ancestors have been transgressing against me to this very day that's right because what let's go to verse four right fast because they are deviant hard-hearted children i'm sending i'm sending I, I am sending you and you are to tell them here is what your whore your Allahim says whether they listen or not this rebellious house will still know that a prophet has been sent among you so that's even with that brothers and sisters 
Even though our brothers and sisters are being rebellious, hard head, stiff neck, don't want to listen to nothing that you have to say, still again, they will know if you if you are there teaching them and telling them what thus says Yah. You know how they be saying, Y'all, thus says the Lord. Thus says Yah, thus says what the most high says. Hey, whether they listen or not, as it says, whether they listen or not. They will still know that a warning came to them. You can't say ain't nobody told you. But if you listen or not, that was on you. That was on you. Let's jump down to seven right fast. And you are to speak my words to them whether they listen or not. See, the most I'm saying, listen, we steal Israel. Got to teach his word whether they listen or not. Whether they pay attention, whether they want to hear it or not. It's still our job to do what? Teach it. What 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 Isaiah says, brothers and sisters, what the book of Isaiah fifty eight says, fifty eight and one, is what it say? Cry aloud, spare not, lift up that voice like a trumpet, right? When we told it to, to, to cry aloud, cry aloud listen, man, because what are we what are, what are we crying loud for? What are we crying loud for, brothers and sisters? We're trying to do what? Save Israel. Save Israel and Jacob from their sin. Where we go here? Let's go right fast. I'm going to leave it right there because I'm going to finish. But what Isaiah 58 and 1 says, now this is the complete Jewish study Bible again. It says, shout out loud. Don't hold back. Raise your voice like a safar. Proclaim to my people what rebels they are in the house of Yaakov their sins to Yaakov shall I get uh, to Yaakov the house of Yaakov their sins that's what we got to do brothers and sisters because like I said he said again even in that what rebels they are but we got to lift that this is so again verse 7 it says the uh, uh, speak my word speak Yah's word speak his Torah speak his Torah speak those the, 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 the teachings and, and the commandments and statues to our people whether they listen or not because it's going to be on them he said for they are very rebellious last one but you human being talking to Isaiah or some says son of man as the King James said hear what I'm telling you don't you be rebellious like that rebellious house hallelujah amen as they say amen amen right there brother and sisters, i like that one what what it said that's key i'm telling you go to these people and speak my word whether they listen or not they ain't paying attention they keep on acting a fool out here the sisters you're trying to raise them up and you're trying to tell them you're not no thought you're not no b you're not no h Brothers, you ain't no thug. You ain't no pimp. You not no player. You ain't no this. You ain't no that. Huh? You ain't no gangster. You Yah's chosen. You Yah's children. And you have a duty to do, brothers and sisters. And even if they don't listen and they keep on what they follow in their foolishness, he tell Ezekiel, and this applies even for us, the rest of Israel as well, who's doing, trying to do our best of our ability to do Yah's will. He says that here, what he told Isaiah, Ezekiel, excuse me, listen to what I'm telling you. Brothers and sisters, he's talking to Isaiah, but I'm putting it as he's talking to her. Listen to what I'm telling you. Don't you be rebellions like that rebellious house. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, praise the most high. Man, I give how could you not? How could you not serve a power like the most high? How could you not? Mm. All praises Abba Yah. Abba Yah told our Abba Yah. Brothers and sisters, I thank y'all for tuning in right here tonight to Liberation Tabernacle of Yah. I said I wasn't gonna be long. I don't know how long I went. <laughs> 
but the uh, whole praise is due is all for the glory of the most high Yah. Um, like I said again, my brother, so you could follow us again on that uh, our podcast, and um, I will have the description of everything in the uh, the links and things in the description. But I said I just want to thank all of your brothers and sisters for who supporting us and even giving us a a listen in and uh, and just, you can subscribe if you want. You know, hey, it's 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 your choice. You know, if you wanted to subscribe. Um, but we just greatly do thank you right here for Liberation Tabernacle of Yah on behalf of my brother as well, who's, you know, like he's not a big YouTuber, y'all. So, you know, you ain't going to really see, you're not going to see him on YouTube. <laughs> so, but uh, on behalf of my brother and the co founder as well, uh, Moray David Israel. Now, you can listen to him on the podcast. Yeah, he, he do he do the podcast. But uh, this, this YouTube thing, he, he, He's, he's not a YouTuber, y'all, I'm saying. So, shalom to you, Brother Dave, shalom. But yes, sir, my brothers and sisters, it's, 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 it's wonderful. Um, I'm having, I'm, I'm just telling y'all, man, I'm having a time of my life serving y'all. And, 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 and I don't care what nobody say. You ain't discouraging me, bro. That the things that y'all been, the favor y'all have been giving me, man, and showing me, ooh, we, the, what they say, y'all, the blessings that have been coming down from y'all, and I know I ain't been all the way right. You know, I know I ain't. I know I ain't all the way right. But y'all still, the favor he been showing me for the little thing. Know that, but, but let me show you something. But he's letting me know that I'm on the right path. He's letting me know the, the things that I am doing, the, the positivity that I'm, that I'm trying to put out and doing, and the reward that he's been been. been Man, just dropping down on me, let me know, hey, you on the right path. And every time that I do something, every time I see these these, these, these things from y'all coming, wonderful things, it gives, and this, that, and coming, man, the changes, wonderful things come in my life. I just said, man, that's from y'all. This is my reward, what he's, what he's giving me for doing, listening unto his words. All praises, and that make me thrive even harder. Bam, bam, come on! I got it. this. Is for y'all. This is for y'all. This is for y'all. I'm listening to them words. I'm listening to them words. <laughs> Cause I listen here. You say, listen here. You know, I, 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 if you listen to my words, these things will be given unto you. But if you don't, see, I've I've, I've had them don'ts, and I had a lot of them not by not listening to his words and a lot of things taken away. Some hardships. We. That's another story. That's another show. But the blessings. There's old. What's that? What old gospel song, y'all? Blessings on blessings. Yeah, wonderful, wonderful. All right, y'all. Shalom, shalom. All power and all glory and all honor goes to none other. Again, one more time, but none of the Most High Yah. Abba Yah, we thank you. For this blessed day one more time that you have given us and allowed us to see now thank you for all the wonderful brothers and sisters out there who's uh israel who know that you are the only power you are our only source and you are our only savior our only god our only redeemer our only all yeah we thank you for allowing us one more time to realize who we are your people your set apart people. And we thank you, first of all, y'all, for just setting us apart. You to find even finding favor in us to choose us to want to do your will and to be your example people to the rest of the nations. What a wonderful privilege that is, y'all. And we gotta realize that uh that's an honor and a privilege for y'all to even found favor in us to choose us to be his example people hallelujah shalom shalom israel have y'all have a wonderful night and to see y'all be some most high willing we see y'all on next show peace